everybody, it's your friend Cyril over at Defunct Games, and I have an important question for you today. What's in the box? Well, it turns out that it's uh, not Primal Rage, but actually a bunch of crap that I picked up at the Consumer Electronics Show back in, I don't know, 93, 94, maybe even 95, so a couple of decades ago. It's a bunch of pins and stuff, and I figured... Why not spend a couple of minutes here just digging through the stuff on top and then, you know, maybe eventually we'll we'll get through all of it. So uh, let's start with this. Get this, uh, the Sega Game Gear uh, stress ball. Never had a lot of stress, so I never used these, but I have a bunch of these stress balls. People were really stressed out in the 1990s. Uh, maybe they were stressed out because they were all playing poker. We got some, some playing cards. I get too excited though. The Sega Game Gear stuff is the only thing different about them. Uh, we got this 3DO button showing showing some support. We got a Pog because it's the 90s. Ah yes, it's the I don't know if you can see that here. It's the Mega Man X. It says the first time Mega Man Adventure for the Super Nintendo. 15. Levels of non-stop super-powered action. Millions of Mega Man games sold. And guess what? It has built-in consumer recognition. Yeah. That's the kind of thing that people are interested about at the Consumer Electronics Show. This is the Jaguar. 64-bit. Do the, do the math. You go get bit at uh, booth uh, 6030. That's, uh, that's fun. This is huge, huge compact bullet stopping button it's huge massive it's like a campaign button uh ask me how to reserve your copy of uh, sony playstation now we got the dominatrix uh sophia from uh the battle arena toshinden don't ask me how to reserve your your unit there's a sega x-men clone wars button that's not very interesting uh, let's see here. Happy Holidays, Express Cellular Products. This is calculator back before everybody had calculators in there. On the phones. All right, this is a Sony Ericsson. Actually, probably before. Anyway, the, it says Unwind with Ericsson. See, it's kind of punny. Um, let's dig around here. Another Jaguar. Uh, we got Bubsy the Bobcat. He's always fun for a good time. It says, whatever blows your hair back. It's the kind of stellar writing you could expect from Bubsy the Bobcat. And maybe we just pull out one more thing here. Let's see, what do we got here? Uh, let's go to the very, very bottom. And let's find ourselves. Oh, yes. Oh, you can barely see that. It's a Sonic 3 button, or pin. We still haven't established if a button is big and a pin is small. I'm sure my commenters will figure that out. We still have a bunch more crap, but we'll get to that another time. Till then, visit Defunct Games and get the hell out of here!